Hey buddy, I'm going to show you how to do uh, your to-do list from the command line using GitHub issues as a cloud backend. Uh, so for this, you're going to need a Ruby gem called the GHI. I I'm using RBENV, so it's uh, installed in the shims directory. I'll show you. Let's see. Yeah, in the shims. Uh, so if you type GHI help, you will see all the commands you can use. If I wanted to open a ticket, I could type GHI open and I'll get an editor. The first line will be the title, so I'll say by milk. Then successive lines will be the details, so I'll say uh, one jug of two percent. And then when I close this out, GHI will signal that it has opened an issue for me. If I refresh in my browser, I'll see in fact I have a new to-do by milk with a comment of one jug of two percent. Now what if I forgot something and I wanted to add to it? I could say GHI comment, um, the ID is seven, so I'll say comment seven. I'll get another editor. I'll say don't forget the skim. Then I get another signal, and in fact, uh, the comment updates automatically in GitHub. That's pretty cool. So once this issue is done, uh, I'm going to first pull up my list of issues. Oh, okay, by milk, I'm going to say that it's done with GHI close 7. And the issue has been closed. If I refresh in the browser, it's disappeared because, in fact, it has been closed. So that is awesome. A command line to-do list using GitHub issues as your cloud backend. Uh, you don't have to do this. use this system just for to-dos. I actually use it uh, sort of virtual sticky notes is just a convenient way to write down thoughts that I might not want to forget. Um, as Big Daddy Kane once said, when my brain cells are lit, ideas start to hit. And uh, this is a super easy way to, to write stuff down so I don't forget it. Enjoy!